Okay, now we've got a jump set up. We're going to start defining gra gravity. So as soon as we start the game, our player falls down. So underneath the last, below the last um, curly brace, type move direction dot y minus equals gravity times time dot delta time. Now this is fairly simple. All we're saying is we want our player to fall on the y axis and minus that using the gravity we defined above and times that by time dot delta time to give it a smooth drop otherwise it's just going to fall robotic very fast and, and if your computer's got a very bad frame rate it's just going to lag now the next thing I really really want to attach is a character controller to our script so var controller it's going to be equal to a get component open bracket character controller close the line and to that character controller we're going to apply some flags so var flags I'll explain this afterwards when I write it down equals controller That's strange. It's not showing up here. Okay, doesn't matter. Um, dot move open bracket move direction times time dot delta time. Basically, this line over here. It's creating a, an invincible flag underneath our character controller, and that flag is going to come in handy for our grounded. Basically, it's going to uh, check our collision for us. So, if we hit something below us, it's going to set the flag to true and then enable our boolean to true as well. Whereas, if we're still in the air, the flag's going to remain false because it's collided with nothing at the moment. But as soon as it collides with something, it's going to set it to true. So let's start putting that in action as well. And, the gra and then gravity should be working perfectly. So grounded, our boolean should be equals to open bracket flag. And sign. Collision. Collision flags dot collided below close bracket apostrophe sign equals zero now as soon as we hit something below it's going to set zero to one and then if we're hitting nothing below it's going to leave it as zero and this script should be working perfectly oh, I did find one error huh. let's see what it was ah. This in bracket. Now, oh, curly brace. Sorry. Copy this. Delete this. And paste it underneath this curly brace. Save it off. There we go. All done. Now, if you run this, our play is going to stop falling down. But as soon as we hit something underneath, we're gonna, it's going to enable our movement. So when the game starts, I'm just going to keep pressing the W key and you're going to notice that it won't let me move while I'm dropping down. There you go. But as soon as I hit the ground, there we go. I can move. Fantastic. So W moves up, S down, A to the left, D to the right. But what about jump? If you press spacebar, we should be able to jump. There you go. Now you can press forward and jump. There you go. So yeah, thank you for watching guys. Hope you learned something new. And as always, thanks for watching.